Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to my let's play of uh, Europa Universalis for a union of Unmar, a triple crown for the lowlands where I'm desperately trying to build up a mercenary force to fight the French which just doesn't work. A new thinker arises, ah, but what may work is killing off that Spanish army over there. It's only 7,000 but it's a start. And if they are at war with other people, anything I can do to weaken them is only going to be a help. Because then they can, other people can actually start fighting. Whereas I think that big French stack is just wandering around, stack wiping the entire rest of the world. The thing is then that's just going to break and go how far back? So I don't think we're going to be able to finish it off in one go. They got reinforced. Oh, reinforced by the entire French world. How can they get places so quick? Oh, they was... The French armies was down here. I saw them. Saxony was far away. It was 7,000. I only had to kill them quickly. I had them um, uh, at least 5 to 1, probably more. And no. No, just... It's not how it works, is it? Go away, France. Decline. They're my cause you stole them during this war. Screw it, I'm, I'm wasting money uh, everywhere, so why not support rebels? Buffini nationalist. You've already revolted, but I think you could revolt again. Local revolt risk plus four in lots of places. <laughs> Cost doubling. It's great. I am going to go bankrupt in this. I've, I've already uh, taken that as a thing. Hopefully, maybe rebels will you know, kill them, which I don't think is a good tactic against the AI, because I'm pretty sure they, they don't... <laughs> Affect them the same way they affect us. Except the demands. See, the French are working their way around here. Actually, you back up to Holland. They've not gone for the sieges like they were, and that's your big stack's just there to wipe us whenever it wants. I mean, it looks like you've probably dealt with your other wars now. I don't know, uh, but you've beaten England as well. Oh, Aragon's been distracted because it's in that other war as well. How? Aragon's in my war? Yeah. And England's losing this war despite that the only land that's been sieged by Portugal. So, I'm doing exactly what the AI wanted and acting as a distraction for them in their war. I'd best start the timer. Oh, and my undefended little flanks. Oh, and yet, despite the fact I'm right next to them, and I had a larger ratio than what the French did, watch your bet. Um, oh, no, not Aragon. Aragon, you was helping the Portuguese out here. In fact, you was probably the only reason the Portuguese was doing well. Um... Yep, they're going to be able to wipe out my army before I can reinforce. When do I arrive? 1st of December. Oh no, I arrived at that perfect time which makes my army sudden retreat. Q game. Just Q. This is a war I'm losing. I'm going to lose it well. And again, just one province over, but I can't get there in time to deal with this battle. But yet the AI marched from southern, well, western France to Saxony. Before I could kill off the uh, Spanish army. How? I need to comprehend better. And none of these I can negotiate with separately. So despite that they're all at low war uh, enthusiasm. 
I could only negotiate with France, and there's no chance in hell of that being doable. A thing. But kill the 1000! Yeah, I didn't think I'd get there in time. Poop and go to Limburg. Poop and come down to Hanover. So they'd have to attack us first. Hopefully we can get them sieges undone. In the meantime, we should still be gaining 100 A. Yep. In how the hell, France? Uh, previous... Oh, France doesn't have any manpower. So if we could keep continuing down this route... Yeah, I, I am wearing them out. Screw it. Pick a plan and stick to it. That worked in the First World War, didn't it? There's a lot more... At least types of infantry available at the moment. All different types of things and uh, very large amounts of cavalry. Another loan. Who the hell would be lending me money right now? <laughs> I wouldn't be. I'm pretty sure I'm what you call a bad investment. But, hey, uh, yeah, people are happy. Maybe this country, which is, you know, decline, um, you know, giving me all this money, will eventually be like, oh crap, we really can't let them lose now. And they'll, they'll come over and help me. You know, America. <laughs> And they're really engaging. Break your sieges. Going to help. Come around this way. Try and filter in. The extra troops which they wouldn't be expecting that filtering in may be enough to... There's no more mercs for me to hire. To, you know, stuff that they weren't expecting. And as nobody expects the Spanish Inquisition, hopefully no, they didn't expect the reinforcements that I'm getting. And they have no manpower, so they won't be regening themselves, so this is you know, purely me. No, we're still going to lose this. So many more men. And we're still going to lose this. Oh, Christ's sake. Right, discipline, yeah, they have 5% discipline on me. Oh, I've taken crap tons of... Well, not really. War exhaustion again. I have a better general, but I have the best general that I can get. I'm filtering in just enough now that it was stopping me from, you know, disappearing. That stacks down to 20,000. And Frenzy Pants, you still have no... Oh, Frenzy Pants, you've fallen down the list a good bit. Some manpower which is more interesting to me. If I can keep your manpower gone, effectively, you may still have a chance. If we also neglect the fact that I don't have any money to keep this up. And you don't have enough manpower to, not manpower, uh, morale to chase after me. That's a start. I got 30,000, 35,000 ish. Where are you going to? Atois? You get a bit deeper into my country. Chase down the little one guy. No, chase him. Don't let him get away. I 
5,000, he's staying there. You want to come down here? No, they're mountain gain and I still don't have morale back. Taking the river crossing. Can I kill them in time? No! Damn it! It's not going to go well now. Fair enough, it's still 2 to 1, but... My troops are in no state to fight. Yeah, the numbers are lower. And we got friends to hire again. I think the rest of this game might be me trying to come back from this terrible fiscal situation like, but I might just go bankrupt. I can't remember what the punishment is for going bankrupt in this game, actually. I knew what it was in EU, uh, free. I like it, I talk in EU and I'm thinking, you know, as if it was D1. It's like, well, <laughs> it was two before it, but it's my one. That's the first one that I played. It's like um, you know, when people talk about their doctor when it comes to Doctor Who. It's the one that they remember from their childhood. Ooh, I was expecting you to running down here-ish. I also hope that that battle was going to go quicker. You going to come up and try and fight? No. 20th. We might catch them. No. They're marching down south. I'm going to try and dive on them. Yay! We won a battle. Poland's actually coming over. Is, are you at war with Poland? Oh, so you wouldn't join my war. Um, but you're happy to come fight with somebody else. In fact, if Poland's coming down, they are my ally. Oh, please say you're having to fight them rebels. Come down to Luxembourg, you're fighting them. An extra 16,000 fresh troops from Poland. Are they going to join a battle with them? They're chasing them down? Okay. We have got one river crossing, but we've merged it with the army of Poland. Ah. Uh, For the army. No, just the army. Oh, come on. Polish troops help. Polish troops fight well. Apparently I've got the leadership in this though, so that's not good. We buy that down before major battle engages, not after. Come on, it's over two to one. All these battles, these French troops must have killed so many people. Oh, brilliant. <laughs> We've lost more territory. Like, not even in a peace deal. We just lose territory, you know, for no reason. Lithuania actually is arriving on the 30th, and you're not my ally, but you are involved in this war, so you can join the battle. Good. I'm right, curious. How many troops does Poland have? Lithuania. 16,000. Poland, 14. France is still at 19. My guys still need to regen. But I'm thinking. I don't, Polish troops don't run away! Lithuanian troops don't run away! I was hoping uh, that that was going to be it, that was going to be able to do it in the Savoyard troops, so it's going to have to die. How are we looking down here? I mean, Castile 
really shouldn't want to be in this war anymore. Although, thankfully, the war's still actually going against England. Yep. Uh, so I don't think they're going to be able to peace out separately. Right. New unit. There's no French armies near me, so I'm, despite being at war, I'm going to take it. These are the same four sieges I've tried for a few times now. I'm hoping there's enough people pestering the... F I'm supporting you! Oh, but no, you were supported by the money from the English, so... Yeah, obviously, kill the other guy who's giving you money. Run away. Run away when you can. Run away when you can. Oh, and uh, what I said about you being at war with the English just doesn't exist anymore. Retreat. Just retreat and regen. <laughs> I can hardly go and get Brunswick, can I? Acknowledge the fact, lose a bit of prestige. I feel like picking on Oldenburg. Thankfully, there is a good number of rebels down here. Actually, there's that good a number of rebels. You guys are that close to being full. Well, let's try and be ready to fight the winner of this battle. Oh no, that's going to go... So much in their favour. My king just died. New king. Yeah, they're losing confidence in my government, but why? What reason did they have to... The 17th. They'll be on the defensive. Twenty-two though with fourteen helping. See if we can coax them into French command instead. Can do. We'll get there first. Twenty-seven to twenty-one. We've got fourteen arriving. We've had some Plantagenet help. This battle's actually going in our favour, and we've got reinforcements. Do you guys want to help? Sweden also, you yeah, no longer fighting the French. <laughs> so they all joined, decided, actually, this ain't going well, and left while we're still stupidly progressing the war. Pause, I want to chase them down. I think that way's going to be the way to go. So you're going to have to walk straight through the rebels, because, you know, the rebels wouldn't want to kill every single one of you that walked through it anyway. Left coalition. Portugal has cancelled military access. Well, they don't need it anymore. Please don't pass through. I mean, it doesn't look like you are, but you know, AI, stupid. Let's see if you can head on to Burn. Where is it? There it is. The emperor is dead. Uh, we got a new one though, so gain Imperial Authority. That's why I'd expect to lose... <sighs> a ran another random... Why am I getting the random ones? I understand the ones that make sense. Okay, they got all their morale back by the time I was able to chase them down. And I just lost an army completely? Maybe? Uh, thankfully, I'm still within 10. France not being in other wars, their manpower is gaining back up to 8,000. I wonder how many of you are screaming at me now. Make peace, you idiot! Never! I'm gonna... 
win another war just so I can say I've won something. <laughs> yeah, kill them. It's 10 to 1. It should auto stack wipe. Come on. No? No auto stack wipes for me. That's just fine and dandy, isn't it? Fine. It's not too expensive. Do it. <laughs> just needed that little bit of help from the other people. They, they just lost. Everyone went to war with France. In fact, let's look at this again. Okay, now just me. Everyone went to war with France. Yeah, now's our time. We can all dogpile on them. Bankruptcy looming. Uh, about a year. Yes. More claims on French land. It's not French land, it's English. It's never. Dutch land. Netherlands land. Netherlands land? That sounds stupid. Um. Okay, tech up. <laughs> There's no reason to do that when at war, but screw it. I'm gonna win a war. I am, guys, honestly. I'm gonna win. I'm gonna lose this one, I'm pretty sure now, like, but it's fine. Keep our armies just so close together. February. Where would she returns? I didn't do anything. Whatever I did, I didn't do it. We might actually get to a point where we could pass a reform. Five princes currently in favour. A lot against. Holstein being one of them. Which is you. Uh, mainly because of the opinion of me. And their opinion of me is terrible because of... Aggressive expansion. So if I played a nice emperor, I could probably get them reforms through. I'm trying to play a nice emperor. This is my defense of the empire. Which I've lost too much for. If I should, if I would have just given it up in the first place and not bothered with this, would be in such a better state. My stupid maximum number of loans. I promised year being neglected. If, if it moves, ta if it moves, draft it. Yeah. They're sending some of their troops away. Still not enough. What happens when I go bankrupt? Prestige decree. Oh, let's see. In addition to emptying our treasury, this will decrease our stability by three. It was already quite bad. You'll lose all monarch points. I'm glad I teched up. Okay, screw this. No choice. Six piece. It's just off it. Send off. Don't even know what it is. They reject it. Uh, Siege of Artois has fallen, so we're probably going to ask for that now. Don't wait for their next offer. I'm sure it's coming. Oh! Didn't see that. I now have no army. So from there... What did they... Break free. What the hell? Where are they? Guess they disappeared. Come on, France, make a peace offer. You won't even take the ones I have to do. 
I can't. I just can't do anything right now. Worrisome. Lose money because I've got plenty of that. Got no army now. Let's try this again. If they're not going to offer me peace, so for peace. Offer tribute. Clear offer. Suggest offer. They'll not accept anything we could offer right now. Well, anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that's all the time we have for today. As always, I'd like to thank you for watching, but unfortunately, I'm going to have to say goodbye. Goodbye.